This course focuses on reimagining work culture. So we're going to be applying Trend Hunter's four E's of modern work culture, but understanding how they're going to play out in our new normal. Back in March of last year, the entire world was told to stay home. And overnight, hundreds of millions of professionals found themselves working from home for the first time, launching what has been described as the world's largest work from home experiment. Now to the surprise of many, the working world more or less adapted. Some definitely better than others. But within weeks of this transition, a new narrative quickly emerged that the office as we know it is dead and that remote only work is the future. But is this really the case? Studies show that 89% of office workers believe that a physical space remains a necessity for companies to remain successful. And 12% of people, which is a very small number, only that amount want to continue to work from home full time once the pandemic is behind us. While so much of the future remains unknown to us, we can say with certainty that the workplace is forever changed. And this isn't necessarily a bad thing. Even before the pandemic arrived, the state of workplace culture wasn't something that many organizations could brag about. We know this firsthand through Trend Hunter's innovation assessment. Through this tool, we've studied over 50,000 global professionals. And from the assessment, we know that 53% of employees don't think that their company adapts quickly enough to remain relevant. 38% feel that their ideas aren't heard or acknowledged. And 47% of employees don't feel that they are provided with the necessary resources to pursue their ideas and achieve their goals. Now, when you apply this internally to your own organization, what would your employees say about how you've adapted? Have you truly listened to your employees throughout the past year? And are your employees truly empowered to weather crisis and chaos? This all matters because at the end of the day, a crisis will only further expose the cracks, weaknesses, and vulnerabilities that already exist within an organization or across a team. And this year, we saw many challenges across dozens of companies, from challenges of employee mental health, to juggling our personal obligations, to social inequality, and general business transparency. These are all issues that companies can no longer put on the back burner. But the good news is that this crisis has created an opportunity for reinvention. Organizations now have the chance to rewrite the narrative of what they want their business to stand for. So what parts of your culture do you want to reinvent? What parts of your culture do you want to leave behind? And how will you create a culture that truly puts its employees first? To help answer those questions, we will leverage Trend Hunter's four E's on modern work culture. We'll look at evolution, engagement, experience, and excellence.